We good? Yeah. My really good friend, he lives right there on the next balcony, not this one, but the next over there. His tomato plants are fucking good. Yeah, yeah. Way better than mine. There's three good ones though. Four? <laughs> yeah, four tomatoes, three months. Stay hydrated. Norway and Sweden probably have better water than us, and Iceland maybe. I heard Denmark is uh, top five. Yeah, this one turned into a real t-shirt graphic now. That's my bike. It's a classic uh, Danish bike. It's nice, family vibe. Did you go by the Red Plaza yet? Did you see they removed everything there? They're really tired of all the skaters bringing crap there. Because they built that little flat ground piece for the skaters. I think they ran out of money or something. So they only built the flat and then we built some obstacles ourselves, but they didn't like the obstacles we built. I hope they're just going to put a big manifest there. Right after this bridge, it gets a little cheaper. That's why I live out here. Once you cross this, it's way more expensive. I prefer they cross the zone out there. It's not really a shop fully, you know, it's more like a, a little office space or a studio kind of. This is really expensive to install, but it was already there. If we we're going to start selling, this is the perfect spot. I'm not sure we're going to be open as a normal store, maybe once a week or something. We have, we have a meeting down here once a week, so we might as well just open the shop when the meeting, when we're here for the meeting anyways. You see, that's that drawing I showed you. Nice. But this is handmade, this is uh, silk screen style. We're gonna make it uh, make it again now, embroidery maybe. Yeah, yeah, we sell two shops, mainly. I think we have 30 shops now, almost. No, we have the same distribution as Polar, Keen distribution. Oh. This one you brought, Polar Skate Co. You should check this board in the toilet. I'm very proud of this board out here. Where did the paper go? Retired. It's okay. I like gripping boards, but I hate changing the tracks. Mm -hmm. But I love new boards, so... I used to skate riser pads, but then I got this wheel welsh, it's called. Now I don't need the riser pads. Especially when the graphic is super simple, and then the colors there, it looks dope. I always try to get really simple graphics. I like when there's just a graphic here and the rest is just empty. That's the first collab we did. See the logo there? It's laser printed. With this skate brand called Heavenberg, you know that? It's a skate shop from Salt Lake City. And it sold out the first day. Boom! It was sick because it was on all these sneaker uh, Instagrams. And there was just all these crazy Jordans and dope colorways. And then our rubber boot just came out. It was really sick. All right. Hello, I'm talking to She's like, are you that exciting that someone's gonna follow you the whole day? And I'm like, hell yeah. <laughs> no wax, that's good. Then we just gotta go faster. They put grass in between? Yeah. That's a good info for all the skate tourists because that's like the main go-to spot for the skate tourists. Yeah. Let's walk up there. Oh, okay, fuck. That's mean. Spot closed. Oh, you can just pull it off. Because the sun never goes down there. So you always end up having a beer after skating. And this guy is saying that he's, he's going to take a break now and then I'm telling him, then you have to stop skating the Red Plaza. <laughs> Most of the tricks I filmed for Polar so far is in this zone. Yeah. I only skate my own zone. Yeah. <laughs> he built a slabby ledge on the Red Plaza right before they took everything away. It was really nice. He found concrete bags on the, on the way home from a party. And then he just took a cap with how many bags? Three bags. <laughs> he stole them. <laughs> okay, let's get a nose slide.
maybe it's rollerbladers who waxed it because it's up here all of it it's not in grind you know yeah it's all right it's just me being a It's fucking weird. You have to really stay down. Maybe here. It's so scary because it goes down a little bit. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> It's really stinking. I do him like kicking my bike, you know. <laughs> oh shit. Crack. Maybe it's good for front crooked when this is off. So it locks in better. Jamie Longlands. Jamie Fisher. Jamie Fisher. Okay. <laughs> Let's eat here, Jamie. At this kebab place right here. I've never had it, but uh, I'm down. German style. We can make it out there. Jump in the water and bike back, pretty much. So crowded. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, this, this spot is right there across the river. It's in the shade. Shade. In the shade. Shade. In the shade. It's been hot for so long that everyone's swimming every day. <laughs> So slippery. Speed is hard to get. Woo! Yeah, Villa. You hear me fight? I'm fighting gnarly. Falafel fight. Hey, I'm out, boys. Yeah, we really have to be back in time because my girl is going to a, a 30 year old birthday, so we can't be late. And I'm going to take care of my kid when she's partying. <gasps> home sweet home. <laughs>